Well, Farrah started the foundation in 2007, a year after she was diagnosed with cancer, and we officially opened the doors in 2010 after she passed away in 2009, and we've been working since to carry on her legacy and do whatever part we can do in helping find a cure for cancer, and also to help those who are struggling with cancer today. That was very important to Farrah. She knew how difficult it is to battle a disease. She felt so fortunate that she was able to afford treatment and you know the be the best treatment and everything and she knew that so many people couldn't and she wanted to be able to help those people and we have Farrah Fawcett Foundation uh, assistance funds in different institutions around the country. I mean I had my own battle I still have a little bit of a battle left but and I, I just feel like it's really important to constantly raise awareness to help others and um, my doctor, Dr. Lawrence Pirro, invited me actually, um, and he is involved with the Farrah Fawcett Foundation. You're the, the, medical, director? the medical director for the Farrah Fawcett Foundation. Um, so yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm honored to be one of his many dates this evening. <laughs>